Today on my show, I had a guest, Mark Trenner, an intellectual property attorney. That means he deals with patents and trademarks and copyrights. And one thing that confuses people a lot is trying to protect an idea. Basically, you can't protect just an idea. You know, I have people call and say, I have a great idea for a new airline seat, or I have a great idea for mining gold, or I have a great idea for this or for that. The idea means nothing. What it has to be is not just an idea, but you have to be able to implement it and have some kind of prototype or diagram or description. And it has to be possible too. You can't just say, well, take some strong plastic and take some strong metal or take some strong gears. It has to be readily available, something that can really be made. In other words, it has to be possible, not just an idea. And when it comes to ideas, so many people think they have a cool name for something or an expression for something. Well, unless you're in that business using that name for a business name or using that expression, you can't simply protect it to keep other people from using it, like the name of a college bowl game or the name of a new vehicle. You can't just come up with a name and say, hey, this is what we're going to use from now on if you're not in that business. That's called squatting. You can't just come up with creative names or expressions and expect to own them and charge everyone for using them. So keep that in mind. Ideas and expressions are not necessarily protectable unless you do something with them. I'm Tom Martino.